Meet Mr. Ajay. He has 4 years of experience and is very proficient in using the pressure vessel design software. Can you tell me the requirements for inspection opening as per code? Tell me, how will you decide it with the help of code? Can you explain the procedure to design a rectangular flange? Can we have different thicknesses for tube sheets for floating head type of heat exchanger? Seems that you are relying on the software very much without code knowledge. This is really a big concern. By depending only on the software for design and calculations, you can never become a good design engineer. And you will also not be able to successfully face any ASME audit. I realize that I need to have a thorough knowledge about the code to be a good designer. Thanks for the advice. Ajay walks back with disappointment. He is now worried and starts wondering how he will be able to get a good understanding about the code. On his way, he suddenly meets his ex-colleague, Vijay, who has recently won the Employee of the Month award for his contribution in a critical project. Hi, what a surprise. How are you here today? Hi Vijay, I came here for an interview. Okay, but you look disappointed. What happened? I wasn't able to answer much about the manual calculations and some code requirements. I see. But you have a good experience in static equipment design. Yes. I have a very good experience on design software. But now, I have realized that, I should have more knowledge about the code and manual calculations. I cannot delay it further. I need to learn and understand as early as possible. But, I don't think I will be able to do it soon because code reading is very tedious and will take a lot of time. I understand. If you remember, I was in the same situation. Our manager used to scold us for the comments we always received from the authorized inspector and customer. And because of lack of expertise and understanding of code, we were not able to meet the deadlines as well. Of course. How can I forget? It is really embarrassing. I am still facing the same problems on daily basis. On the contrary, I can see that you have made tremendous progress. How did you achieve it, in such a short time? 